and realizes she is going to be a different today. Meanwhile, Mahogany Head, Pico, she's Mahogany Head at the time, Pico got married. She helps Miss Dishman. And they are driving up to Anderson, they're driving up from Anderson County to Campbell County. And Miss Dishman says, I gotta tell you something. And at that point, Miss Dishman tells her about the kidnapping, about beating Miss Paxton with a bat, about having her chained to the bed rail for days, tells her about the choking and killing, and tells her she's in the freezer. And that freezer is in the bedroom closet. It is in Sean Finnegan's closet. Mahogany says we have to call the police and does that. And they report and they send them back here to Anderson County. So they are en route back here and Mahogany calls her fiance, now husband, Colt Pico. And he calls the police. So we have, again, these roads converging. Uh, Mahogany and Rebecca are on their way to Anderson County, getting to Anderson County. Colt Pico calls 911. While he's calling 911, Sean Finnegan, all these roads converging now, is on his doorstep saying you should mind your own business, angry at him, cursing him, and you'll hear that 911 call from Mr. Pico here from him telling you about this incident where he's telling the police, here's what my wife is telling me, and this guy's on the doorstep. So the officers are right. That's where we began. That's a, what's this on here? So we 